An accused killer is locked up following a deadly shooting that took the life of a woman in Tampa. It happened yesterday on 23rd Street North, and that woman was not the only victim. Annie Mapp joins us live. She's at the Hillsborough County Courthouse, where that accused shooter faced a judge today. Annie? Stacy, police accused 42-year-old Michael Banks of killing a woman, shooting his mom, shooting his teenage daughter, and also firing shots at a Tampa police officer. Today, a Hillsborough County judge denied his bond. I want to warn you, details in this case are disturbing. Starting on page 49 with Michael Banks. In a post-Miranda interview, 42-year-old Michael Banks told detectives what prompted him to load his revolver and start shooting inside this home on North 23rd Street. He's just not a, a good person, you know, he's prone to violence. Court documents state Banks told detectives he felt betrayed and upset as his mother and her friend discussed him moving out due to his desire to enter a relationship with his teenage daughter. That's why Banks told police he shot the deceased victim in the head and then shot at his mother raising her in the head as she managed to flee the home. She's just been through so much. And for him to heap more on her, you know, it, it's just terrible. The suspect told detectives he then shot through the bathroom door where his daughter was showering. Court documents state the teenager was shot in the leg as she also tried to escape. And when police arrived on scene after several calls to 911, the suspect fired two shots at an officer. Police did fire back, but did not hit the suspect. The suspect said he then placed the revolver on the table and surrendered. I was just sitting in here in my in my living room. I, I saw the police pull up. I heard the gunshots. And the suspect is no stranger to law enforcement. He is a convicted felon for an aggravated battery on a pregnant woman. Now, despite that criminal history, he told police he managed to purchase that revolver online. He will be back in the Hillsborough County Courthouse next week for a pretrial detention hearing. Reporting live in Tampa, Annie Map 8 on your side.